video we learned all about fruit and where they grow. So today I thought we'd get creative with fruit and make a delicious fruit butterfly. Now as all parents know sometimes it can be tricky to get children to eat their quota of fruits to keep them healthy so this is a really good way to have fun with your child and to encourage them to eat something delicious at the end of it. So let me show you how to do that. To save some time, I've already cut up a selection of fruits. So let's see what we've got on our plate. We've got some grapes, pineapple, cherries, strawberries, kiwi, plum, orange segments, and a banana. And we're gonna try and incorporate all of these into our butterfly. So let's first think what a butterfly looks like. Well, a butterfly is an insect. So all insects have three body parts, a head, a thorax, and an abdomen. But we're going to just use a banana to represent all of those three. So all we do, we just take the banana and cut it in half and lay it in the centre. Butterflies, as we know, have wings and they actually have a forewing and a hindwing which come together and function as one wing. So we're going to use our pineapple as the forewing, which is a little bit bigger, and we're going to use the plum as the hindwing. Now, butterflies are symmetrical, which means that their patterns are the same on one side as the other. So we're going to create the same thing on the other side. And there are our wings. There are many different species of butterfly and they all come in a different combination of colours and patterns. So we're going to create some colour to our butterfly wings. And we're going to do that by adding some extra fruit. So we're going to add some kiwi around the edge to create some colour and then we're going to add our cherry in the middle as a little spot. We can then incorporate some colour onto the hindwing using some orange segments. Butterfly wings are symmetrical which basically means that the pattern is the same on one side as the other and a really good check, way to check this is by using a mirror. So if you just pop a mirror along the middle of the banana and look in to the mirror you'll see what the other side should look like. So here is the finished butterfly with a symmetrical pattern. All we need to do now is to add some antennae. So we're going to use these two which come from the cherries to create the antennae. And there you have it. So I hope you've enjoyed creating your fruit butterfly and more importantly I hope you enjoy eating it. Thanks for joining me everyone.